Morton Grass Elementary. This is Olivia and Callan with your blog broadcast. Today is Tuesday, June 4th and day 5 of the special subject schedule. Our Takes Pride theme for this month is self-esteem. Self-esteem is how we feel about ourselves. We can feel good about ourselves when we know we are doing our best. If you have high self-esteem, you will believe in yourself and, and know that you can do things well. Let's take a look at, the, at how these teachers build up their own self-esteem. Hi, this is Mr. Krebs, and I build up my self-esteem by trying hard every day, doing my best, and keeping a positive attitude. Hi, this is Mrs. Malloy, and ways that I help to build up my self-esteem is that I'm very aware of my self-talk, so when I'm talking to myself in my head and I'm trying to tell myself stuff, I always try to be very, very positive, and that helps build up my self-esteem. Thank you. Hi, this is Mrs. Teeple. I build up my self-esteem by doing puzzles that are brain teasers and they're tricky and I like to do them for fun and then when I solve them um, it makes me feel better about myself and I love it so much my second graders even made me extra puzzles to do at home because they know how happy it makes me hi I'm Mrs. Tarasevich and I think positive self-talk can be a really awesome thing and I think for me even as an adult I always set small goals for myself and as I'm trying to achieve these goals, I think of positive things and the things that I say to myself to help achieve those goals. So I do a lot of running and I'll say to myself, if I can get to that next street or if I can get to that next stop sign, I'm achieving a goal and it helps me to think positive and to be able to achieve more things in a day. Hi, I'm Miss Witty. I build my self-esteem every morning coaching myself to make sure I'm in the green zone every single day. And the way that I boost my self-esteem is by going to yoga. Um, I try to go three times a week and I take care of myself and I self-reflect there. Hello, this is Mrs. Gross and I build my self-esteem by continuing to do the things I enjoy. So those things include continuing to make my artwork, I continue gardening because I love when people compliment my house, and um, that's how I build up my self-esteem. Okay, so now I understand. We were responsible for building up our own self-esteem. Yep. Happy birthday to the following students. Luke Holtz, Jonathan Smakula, Carter Wallow, and Isaiah Welch. We hope you have a great day. Special announcements. Field day is Friday, so be sure to wear your team color and wear sunscreen and bring plenty of water. Now outside to Sadie and Giselle for the weather. I can't seem to find Giselle anywhere today. Would you mind doing the weather? Sure. Thank you, Callan and Olivia. We are looking at a beautiful week. Today is mostly sunny with a, and a pleasant with a high of 72 degrees. Tomorrow's high will be in the low 80s, 80s with a chance of an even thun, thunderstorm. And the rest of the week looks perfect. Now back to our main studio. Thank you, Giselle and Sadie. Now to Kai and Sloan for our shout outs. Thank, Thank you, Callan and Olivia. Olivia. Shout out to Mark McCreary and Alex Schaffsteller for showing responsibility in all their schoolwork, especially as it gets harder to focus with the year winding down. Shout out to Austin Keller for cleaning up in the bistro even though it wasn't his job. Thank you, Austin. And a shout out to Julia Coons for all her help with the Bulldog broadcast. She works independently and is reliable. Thank you, Julia. Now, now back, back to, to our, our main studio. studio. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Kai and Sloan. We have been enjoying listening to fifth graders' favorite memories. Let's take a listen on more of their favorite grass memories. Hi, I'm Sophie, and my favorite memory of um, grass was in third grade when um, me, Avery, and Sammy did the um, talent show. <laughs> <laughs> oh, me. Oh. My name is Brittany, and I remember a time at Gettysburg when I got very, very muddy, and it was fun because it actually felt like I was, like, charging, uh, charging and feeling like what the soldiers felt like. Hi, my name is Maddie. My favorite memory at Grass was in fifth grade when I won a cotton candy machine and a snow cone machine at um, Bulldog Bingo. 
Hi, my name is Kaya. This is my first year here, and my favorite memory is making all new friends. Hi, my name is Mason, and my favorite memory at Grass Elementary was the kindergarten field trip to the Elmwood Park Zoo. Hi, my name is Ian, and my favorite memory at Grass is the fourth grade field trip to Harrisburg. <laughs> Hi, I'm Suzanne. My favorite memory is being at Girls on the Run and meeting lots of new people. Hi, my name is Claire, and my favorite memory was when I interviewed the first grade teachers. Hi, my name is Peter. My favorite memory of JM Grass is the fifth grade Gettysburg field trip. Hi, my name is Jade, and my favorite memory is also the fifth grade Gettysburg field trip. All great memories. Thank you for sharing. Students in younger grades, please start thinking about your favorite memory for the year. This could be a project you worked on or something big you learned or even something special with a classmate. We'll be sharing some of your memories too. We, we hope, hope you enjoyed this edition of Bulldog, Bulldog Broadcast. We show our best care behavior in the classrooms, in the bistro, on the playground, on the bus, and at home. Let us all do our part to make this a cares kind of day, because a bulldog always cares. Have a great cares day, Grass Elementary, because at JM Grass we go above and beyond.